Hey Buckeyes, welcome back to your Tuesday Scarlet Scoop. I'm Ariana Bernard and let's get right into today's top stories. Students of Ohio State Student Farm Worker Alliance marched from Goodale Park to the Ohio Union on Sunday in protest of Wendy's refusal to join the fair food program. OSU spokesman Chris Davey said the university is actively working on finding a resolution for this and that OSU has a firm commitment to social responsibility and actively supports appropriate treatment of workers. The fair food program works to ensure the protection of rights and wages for farmers and farm workers in Florida, according to their website. Unlike McDonald's and Burger King, which buy their tomatoes from farms in Florida that are protected by the Fair Food Program's Code of Conduct, Wendy's gets its tomatoes from Mexico. President Drake took a ride in a hydrogen fuel cell powered bus this past Friday in order to explain how the bus works. The bus will be entering the cab's fleet for a year and is part of a Stark Area Regional Transit Authority's line of fuel cell buses. The bus uses hydrogen as its main energy source to charge its batteries and produces zero emissions. Drake stated it is the way of the future for highly efficient, cost-effective, and pollutant-free transportation. To learn more about this story and how the bus operates, visit thelantern.com and click on campus. Harry Potter fans experienced the movie in a new way this weekend through live music. The Columbus Association of Performing Arts screened a Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone on a 40-foot high-definition screen at the Ohio Theater. The Columbus Symphony Orchestra played the soundtrack to the movie live. The Harry Potter film concert series started in June 2016 by Sin Concerts, a pro producer of live music, as a way to bring a new twist to an already beloved series. Here's an inside look. That's all we have for you on today's Scarlet Scoop. Be sure to tune into Lantern TV throughout the week as well as check out thelantern.com for all your campus news. Also, don't forget to like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Take care and thanks for watching.